Farmers are losing cattle and other livestock due to tick bone disease, which has become a threat to the national herd, which currently stands at 15 million cattle. However, Makerere University College of Veterinary Medicine and Alpha Sun Uganda Limited, with funding from State House Innovation Fund, has invented the anti-tick vaccine that will solve the problem. That are used of using chemical acaricides to control tick control tick control ticks and tick borne diseases found all these solutions they offer new opportunities which can be which which when used in the integrated tick control strategy they will be able to eliminate the growing concern of tick resistance they will be able to reduce acaricide use and they will be able to reduce the instance of these tick borne diseases the mission of the Antic Vaccine Production Initiative is to develop a recombinant vaccine using proteins identified from local ticks that would be used as part of the package in the control of ticks through vaccination. In Uganda, if not managed well, we could face a situation where there is a reversal of economic gains, uh, not just of this government but of individual families. Because research has been done to show uh, that a family that does crop husbandry uh, versus a family which does uh, livestock rearing or a combination. The one which has a component of livestock rearing is better. Uh, it is therefore important that if we are seeing signs of threat to the livestock industry, be it cattle, be it uh, goats, pigs, uh, we need to act. And it is uh, therefore critical that uh, the you know, as you know, the benefits that accrue from livestock, be it nutrition, you've heard of issues of children being malnourished because of milk, uh, not being enough. We the Vice Chancellor, Makerere University, Professor Barnabas Nawangwe, says the innovation of the antique vaccine has set a new door for Makerere University, which has become a truly international research university. The vaccine is one of the most advanced scientific endeavors ever. And to see that we have built the capacity at Makerere now to produce a vaccine is testimony that the university has reached the highest levels of research capacity. Winning the league of those universities which do research for development. The Memorandum of Understanding has been signed for a period of 10 years and the product is going into the final process of clinical trials. Sudat Kai, Ivan Joko, UBC.